Welcome back in after the whistle. Tristan Thomas here chatting with Cody Campbell, head coach of the Minot Minotauros. Uh, season already underway, starting to get those first few home games underway here at the Pepsi. Uh, you know, you've, you've played some games away from here so far. What have you liked about what you've seen uh, in those games? Well, we really liked our, our compete level down in Blaine. Those were, uh, you know, went three and one, but probably played well enough to, to win all four of them. And uh, like the compete level and the maturity of the group. We've got an older team, more experienced team, just in terms of how many guys have played junior hockey uh, prior to arriving here. And then a lot of guys that have, have significant number of games under their belts uh, with the Toro. So um, like that about the group for sure. And it, it's just a, a continuing process that uh, we try to build on every day and make sure that we continue to develop these players and, and we're getting better individually, but as a group, as a whole, uh, most importantly, um, so that, you know, Friday and Saturday night when people come out to the Mesa, they see an exciting product on ice. Yeah, and last time we talked, you mentioned uh, a lot of scoring to replace from last year. Just a lot of pieces overall to replace. How have you seen those new roles kind of, uh, kind of divvy themselves out? Yeah, it's just kind of uh, a natural process and guys take advantage of opportunities that, that they get throughout the course of the year and um, it's uh, that's still ongoing. It's something that uh, changes week to week, but especially early in the season, guys are guys are starting to, to get comfortable with their role and um, a little bit more of scoring by committee here thus far, uh, which I don't think is a bad thing. I think we have one of our, our strengths of our team is our depth and uh, a little bit different than, than last season, but um, it, it's, it's been exciting to watch them grow together here in the first couple months. Of course, last season coming off a playoff run, what's it going to take for this crew to, to get to a similar spot and then get back to the playoffs? Yeah, we just got to focus on, on the day-to-day. -day. Uh, uh, that stuff is a long way away, and um, we just gotta, we got to take care of business day-to-day -day and, and make sure that we continue to get better, as I said before, and uh, the guys can continue to come, become closer that uh, especially in this sport but in any sport teams that really care about each other seem to have the most success and uh, I think we've got a, a group of guys in that locker room that uh, are really starting to, to form a pretty cool bond. You mentioned uh, some of the newcomers who are a, a couple of the new new names new faces that uh, some of the people who come out to watch you get their, your games should be uh, aware aware of and should look for. Yeah Pavel Funtek uh, can't miss him he's six foot seven you know, probably six nine on skates uh, from Slovakia he's been really good this far committed to University of Alaska Anchorage right after the showcase uh, to play his division one college hockey there he's a guy um, Chad, Chad Mueller has been been really good for us. I think he's going to turn into a player that fans really enjoy watching play, not only because of the skill level and ability to, to score goals, but he's he's always in the in the middle of something, um, and a high energy player. Joel Lettinen, uh, Finnish player that, that's over here, has, has had a good start for us thus far. Um, uh, you know, all of our goalies have been, they're all new, but they've all been pretty good here early on. And, That'll be a, an ongoing battle in, in the net for sure. But uh, I think those guys, and uh, you know, you can ask me that in a week, and there'll probably be some more names to say. Yeah, and of course, goalie obviously a, a big position for, for any hockey team. And last year was kind of a, a committee kind of in, in net for you. Are you expecting something similar? I guess how you kind of assess that position right now? Yeah, right now something similar. We we have to just have such a small sample size of our team. Um, we haven't been in in too many different situations and. Seeing that, to see how guys react and that kind of stuff, but I'm I'm very confident in the, just the talent level that uh, that we have at that position, and um, it's good to have options in that position too. That that paid off for us uh, hugely last year. Yeah, for sure. Well, looking forward to a long, fun season of hockey right here at the Mesa. Awesome. Thanks for having me on. Yeah.